na 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 what up y'all we back with another video it's your girl ash in a cut i'm gonna put my instagram below in the description bar it's your boy j j a y not the letter j um. <laughs> <laughs> this video is going to be about how we met so this should be an interesting video because i get this question a lot they be like how long you been with your girl seven years damn So we are about to get started and we're gonna go from the beginning to the end. So, um, where do you wanna start? I don't even know. <laughs> you gonna tell them how you slid in my DM or? First of all. We gonna tell them about how we met and then how we got to that part. That's what we're gonna do. You go first. No, you go tell first. them. What's your first memory? When my baby girl Tayshauna, rest in peace Tayshauna, one day we were in a hallway at Shimani's house, my cousin, and she was like, Tayshauna was like, my boy, my boy Des about to come over and we about to chill, whatever, cool, whatever, boom. So she gets over there and they're in the hallway chilling, doing whatever they doing, and I just so happened to walk by and when I walked by, I saw this handsome looking little thing, you know, dang on brand, whatever. <laughs> At the time, you had your little corn, you had cornrows, you was wearing all black. She cuts and grows her hair over and over. Anyway, she was sitting on the stairs and she was with Tayshana, they was chilling, and she introduced us. When Tayshana went back in the house, I was like, who that? Who that? Fact, she was fronting too, trying to make it seem like. <laughs> Boy, chicken is crazy. <laughs> but I was taken at the time though. Right. The whole girl. I was at my girl crib actually. Well, my girl at the time crib when I pulled up over there. She was like, "You going over there to see chicken and her girl and her girl cousin? Cause I know her cousin be over there." I'm like, "What are you talking about?" Like, and the crazy part. I don't even know Shimani. I was going over there for chicken. I didn't even know know who she was at the time. I knew she looked good, and I knew I liked what I saw. And then. Why well, I have to tell the whole story? Why you can't nah, tell the story? Nah, you're not telling the whole story. story. It was like two years later, three years later? Like. Nah, it had to be way longer than that. No, it was like, like a year later. It was not no year later. It had to be like a year later because. It couldn't have been a year later. It had to be like at least two. Possibly. Because when that day, that was like New Year's Eve. That when was I 2011. Up that was 2009 or 10. No, I'm saying. She passed in 2011. Yeah, that's when you went in my DM. I'm saying when why we first seen each other. Why you keep saying <laughs> that? <laughs> anyway, it rolled over 2011. My son Chicken passed away. Um, I'm at my homegirl Nia's crib. It's me, some girl I'm talking to at the time, some girl Nia's talking to at the time. We all four macking. Mm -mm -mm. My phone DM. Boop boop. Hey. Just seeing how you doing, it's the girl that was in the hallway with you that time with chicken. Just trying to make, seeing if you remember me. Wow. <laughs> First of all, I was like, I was just seeing if you was okay because I knew that was your man's. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, what yeah. I said. Facts. And me, I was a whore at that time, like, fresh off the breakup. My wings was like. You ugly. I just, <laughs> I just hit her with the, text me. <laughs> no, she, you, re you really did, though. They need a number and put text me. So I'm like. Right, cool. So I text her a few times. Like I would text her and she would like she would respond back to me, but like it would be on like her time. Like like it was weird. Like she would respond back to me when she I was making moves. Right. <laughs> yeah, I bet. She was sus. She was sus when she would respond back to me. It was probably like two or three times that I would write her and like I just really, really wasn't feeling the response. One day I texted her and I was like, this is my last time writing you. Cause I feel like when I hit you up, I either get one worded or you don't really respond back to me. I was like, I'm not gonna hit you up anymore. Blah, 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 blah. She was like, nah, nah, I'm gonna call you tonight. I'm gonna hit you up in a second or something like that she was supposed to, she was supposed to do. She ended up doing it. And pretty much that night we spoke on the phone. Till like six in the morning. Yeah. 
We Thanks. talked about like mad stuff. You would have thought that we known that we've been to each other. Like we talked about everything. Like we talked about everything but sex. <laughs> right. That's the like, part. We was joking on the phone so much that we talked about everything but sex. Like, to the point where we didn't we talk about nothing about like other. horniness, like nothing like we were just vibing literally just vibing everything for hours facts to the point where i went to sleep while like we went to sleep on the phone with each other woke up like hello yeah at that at that time i was taken and she was she wasn't taken she was i had like the three yeah five, she was five, doing the six that's not cute that's when I was like, a whore. I was going through a lot at the time. My man's had passed. But there's something in you. Then about you, girl. <laughs> girl, bye. Anyway, we spoke, and after that, we just really kind of clicked. Like, nah, facts. And that was in 2011. We talked on a phone for probably like a good week. Yeah, like a week. For like week a good and week, half. yeah. And then that's when we arranged to meet up. And then so, we met up in the city. Right. The crazy part about it, I thought that she lived in New York. I didn't know at the time she was living in Connecticut. Within that week and a half time of us talking, that's when I found out that she would be back and forth or whatever. So we scheduled to meet up, and she actually came to see me. And we met up at 34th Street. From that very day that we met, she was supposed to stay with me that weekend. Ended up staying that. To this very day. <laughs> <laughs> I know that sounds crazy. But she literally is supposed to stay the weekend with me. Not even the weekend. She was supposed to stay that day with me because, Wait. sorry, you, she was supposed to go to her sister's house. Right. But she ended up staying the weekend with me. After we spent the weekend together, we were it just was like, like attached like magnets. Yo, like, that, it was bad. We were, we were like, like you couldn't, if you seen her, you seen me. And you yeah. gave me the coons. <laughs> Snapper fish. <laughs> Gonna be shot. I actually had a crush on her for like a good year before we, you know, started. To before she slid in my den. Right. I seen her before. Was this was I think Twitter? Because back then Twitter was popping. So it was well, like MySpace. It was either MySpace or Twitter. One of them. I seen her and I was like, damn, yo, she looked good. But it wasn't like one of those things where I was like, who she know or anything like that. So when I seen her again. The time where when I actually met her through Tayshauna, I was like, damn, she looked good, not realizing like that's the same person that I already that had a crush same on. Nigga, I seen. Shut up. I realized it like a little bit after. Facts. Mind you, we knew the same people. That was grew cool. up around the same people. We literally would talk about what we see ourselves five years from now, ten years from now. Right. We talked about like our living situation. Like at the time when she met me, I was going through some stuff. I still seen the beauty and all the struggle that was going on. For real. Cause a nigga <laughs> was struggling. A nigga was doing bad. But yeah, Just anyways. I was I was going through some stuff and she accepted me and, and we both and helped seen each other past out. all of that. Right. And built each other was, up. It's crazy how now, all these years later, we are literally we're doing everything that we talked about. Like that we said we would do. Yeah. She's my best friend. And I think that's the beauty of being in a relationship when you're able to have a soulmate and a best friend. We can have disagreements and also agree to disagree. Right. Not feeling like she's gonna put me in a position to fail. We've seen a lot of people fail that started with us. And, and there's a few couple that's still going, but I be Yo, seeing people crazy, fail yeah. and I be like, dang. Like, are we next? Like, I started getting scared. I think that the fact that chicken put us together is I really believe something that. Something powerful that's like keeping us together. Like, yeah. when I talk about chicken, I be thinking about- And it's about, just crazy, like we, we just, I don't know, like the way we vibe, like, God forbid say we didn't last. I don't think that I would find what I have with you right now. I'll be happy and I'll move on, but you only get this type of relationship. Right, 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 right. Whether it work out or it don't, it's just, love. yeah. We've been through some things, so. though. That's how we met, and we're here. Everybody now. Here seven years? Seven years. I will never forget the time when she asked me to be her girlfriend. The day after my birthday. It was supposed to be on her birthday, but it was the day. I was a little after. drunk, a little schmiz. 
smells like, a little you dress. Be my girlfriend. <laughs> That's back in the day when you dad had to ask people, like you had to ask Shorty right. to be your girl. Like, you Cause if you never asked her, she'd be tight like you ain't asked me to be your girl right, so, yet. You was fiending to put it on the book to get all my little shorties mad. Yo, one thing. You was I, arguing with mad girls for I like the first three so, months. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know why you're saying first few months. That's the neg that's negative. First few months. <laughs> because she has so many Tatiana's, people didn't really take us serious. And then what topped it off was we got our names tatted on each other literally like our second month day in. Two months in. Two. And we went all the way to the Bronx for these whack ass tattoos. <laughs> I would never. <laughs> Every time I see my tattoo, I'd be like, yo, job. I want to cover it up. Yeah. I don't be saying that I want to cover it up because it's her name, but. Yeah, I feel the same. They, I don't even want to show them. If I see her, her now, you, like, I, I, I got her. My have, name is good. Don't show them. My I'm name not is long. Show her name, name. When I turn my neck, don't you should see it. It's all the way back here. You see how you see my music her, when you, I turn my neck like that? One of the letters in her name faded away like it didn't <laughs> even. <laughs> It doesn't even have her name anymore. No, nah, no. It was one of those things where we was like so in love and just like, yo, like, nah, tell my I'll name on you so I, so I know so it's I real. Know, and I was so corny. I'm and I wanted it on you. my neck. I wanted everybody to see. I was like, give me I your neck. I really think that was my caption when I posted the picture. Yeah, All I remember was my sister writing so me. She said, Y'all better be together forever. I was just about to say that. <laughs> I swear, I was just about to say that. So my many bad. people like doubted us, and it was like, not because they didn't want to see us together, but she was a whore. And like, I I was all over the place. Like You was a I whore was, too. I was not a whore. I was just like, okay. I was just I was finding myself. And that's what they all say. Finding trying to find love. When she came around, I already had a crush on her. So <laughs> long story short, she brought me out Michelle, helped me come out the closet, and um I'm all about that yin yang. Right. <laughs> How they know we've been together for seven years. They know all the juicy part. They yeah, know that's just a little something, living together something. since we've been together. Yeah. Her mom took me in at 17, y'all. I was living in New York and she said, I'm bringing you back home with me. That's how we ended up still like this. You going to CT. <laughs> but anyways, she was a little birdie-ish when I first got with her, but. But now I'm a lady. When my family took her in, they turned her into this. Girl, Bob, get on that face. <laughs> <laughs> that was the video on how we met, and we hope you guys enjoyed it. We want to do we a gotta get some people that's interested in us, right? You gotta be interested in us. Like we really need we like if you want if you want to see more or know more about us, we need you guys to like comment, subscribe. Definitely comment. We need to know what you want to see or Facts. what is it that you y'all want us to do. Like Facts. so we could you know make it more exciting for you guys and just kind of. Keep going. We're new to YouTube, so we're still learning the ropes, but we're definitely excited and we want to keep more videos coming in and we want to keep y'all entertained. Stay tuned for the next video. Peace, love, and blessings.